A few weeks ago, I was contacted um, by an old acquaintance of mine from high school who's really interested in becoming an author. I am not traveling too much lately, so I thought I would have him uh, meet up with me and kind of try and walk him through some of the things that I've learned um, about author life in the past few years. Hi, my name is Clayton. Um, I went to high school with Lindsay. I, I think I had a class with him in high school or something, but we were not friends. We were best friends. Yeah, we uh, hung out a lot, always had lunch together. Um, sometimes I would sit at her table and she would be like, get out of here. And I, uh, I just wouldn't. He actually thinks that I wrote The Hunger Games. I was talking to some friends the other day and I heard uh, she wrote The Hunger Games and I was like, I I've heard of those movies. <laughs> So uh, it's always been a dream of mine to write um, a story, a book. I feel like I've got the process down. You know, how hard could it be? I don't think he has any idea of what he's doing. Writer's boot camp! So today I thought I would walk Clayton through the actual life of an author and see if he's ready to handle it. How do you spell uh, Jingleheimer Schmidt? Uh, hey Lindsay, uh, it actually, actually really hurts down here. You, you don't have like a stool or Maybe uh, something better than concrete. I don't really think you have what it takes to make it. You're right. So the first thing I like to do when I get up in the morning is drink as much coffee as I can possibly fit in my stomach. So after I have my coffee, I like to yeah. I like to kind of think about the idea that I'm going to work on for that day. Like your concept, like you, you come up with concepts, a plot, like... I thought, I kind of thought you were going to do that. Uh, there's a boy. He's, uh, <clears throat> he's a wizard. He doesn't know he's a wizard. Harry, right. Harry Potter. Uh, another boy. He's the son of a Greek god, say of the ocean, beside maybe, I don't know, it could change. He doesn't yeah. know he's the son of Percy Poseidon. Jackson. Okay, there's death all the time, and you can't go out at night, and uh, there's lots of murder. Um, starts out, girl on a beach. Oh, that's you? So I find that you have to have a really good balance between all the different aspects of your story. So like plot, character, darkness and light, action scenes, um, conversations, dialogue. The pacing, it can't be too slow, it can't be too fast. But don't want people to feel like oh they're gosh. getting like whiplash when they're reading your story. Oh so uh, once you lose that balance when you're working on your concept or your story, then you're gonna lose the reader's interest. So I want Clayton to get really good at the balancing act that's required to write a story. Go. All right. While I'm working on this scene, why don't you go and walk my dogs for me? I'll be right here when you're done. Okay. Ah! 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 Learning to get in the creative headspace comes with unlocking a certain creativity that you have inside. Um, so you go ahead and go out here. Oh, I, okay. I'm gonna lock you out. Um, oh. So good luck with that. Oh. Hey, Linz. Hey, it's been like three hours. I think I'm done for the first day. Uh, I feel I feel like it's doing a lot of good though. I feel I feel like a writer. So I'm, I'm gonna be back for another round of training at some point. I don't know. I guess I need to text her. I left my phone in there. Yeah. Is he gonna wave? <laughs> hey! Synchronized wave. Uh, uh. Uh. <laughs> Uh. <laughs> okay, in all seriousness, this is Clayton Farrell. He is a very good friend of mine since high school. We actually were friends in elementary school from church, and then we forgot that the other one existed. True story. We met in high school in a creative writing class, 
we became friends, um, and now he is one of my husband's best friends. Yes, so Lindsay um, has been killing the author game. Um, it's been a long time dream of mine to write uh, professionally, and so now I am pursuing that dream. She's being an awesome, awesome friend by helping me out. And um, I'm going to be documenting my process with my first book um, over on my channel, so be sure to check that out. We'll leave a link in the comments. Hey, synchronized Ooh. pointing. Uh, so stay tuned for author boot camp day two. Um, do you want to help me do this signing out? Yeah. How do we do that? <laughs> sign out, or we sign out, or we're signing out. Signing out. What, what do you do? Do you point it? I don't know how to sign out. I've never done this before. You're doing a great job. Okay. Uh. <laughs>